Hello friends, you are with Adlebonair. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to make your program dot as dot x and changing its icon with the use of Microsoft Visual Basic 6.0. So without losing your time, let's start. First of all, I'm going to show you my program. This is my program. The system one. As you can see, this is a program. When I first run it, here there is the icon, the default icon of the program. How to change mm -hmm. this default icon? So we go here to the icon and press on it. And here you see that there is no the icon. So let me first make the icon. Let me design the icon. You can design uh, the icon in this way because it's the way that I prefer to use. And you can choose this way because it's the best way of designing the icon. So it's your right. Sniping tool. I'm using sniping tool to snip my icon. So let me first type in the letter so I need it to be L letter L my icon I need it to be letter L I will increase this size because this size is so good this letter L so after I will capture it using sniping tool just go to the search and type in sniping tool you see it so I don't want to capture it. But I'm very, very sorry. I think so. So new and capture this part. So save it. So you see that. I'm going to save it in the folder that my pro where my program is. I will call it icon one and save it. After saving it, close this interface and yeah, so we so I'm going to change the icon. So you see but that my icon is not appearing to the list so why my icon is not appearing to the list is because the icon is not having the extension which is icon or dot curl you see that here there are five five of type so here there is i dot ico and dot cur so i don't have the my image don't has those extension any of these extensions so I'm going to convert my captured image into dot icon uh, I'm going to use the software to convert this image I will use the software which is called the format factory but if you don't have the format factory here I have the link where I can get the format factory is this link this link is where I can get the format factory. So I'm going to convert that image. This is the image that I have captured. Let me first show you. So it's this L. Let me close it. So format factory. Wait a little bit. So you see that here there are a list of icon. So I will choose this icon dot icon. Press OK. Start. Completed. So the format factory defaultly saves its files to this folder FF output. So my icon is here. I will cut it to the folder 
Where are my my program is paste it so close it and accept your program and here this is the icon see that the icon is lit I will press on it open you see that the icon is successfully changed so try to run it and you see here there is the icon that I provide so after I'm going to show you now how you can make it.x uh, an executable program without opening the interface of VB. So I'm going to, to go here make system12.x. So my program is system12, but I need to call it system123. Yeah. So I will just press OK and after this process to finish i will uh, access my program here oh sorry it is here so you see that my program is this system one two three when i try to open it it is here this is its icon let me try to make it as a shortcut. Send it to desktop. Make it as a shortcut. So, you see that here there is system123. Open it. Yeah. This is a program, a completed program. So, you see that it is open. But when I try to open this, you see that. It will first open the VB and I had the arrows. So I don't want this. So this is how you can make your program as a dot x and change its icon. Let me show you its extension here. You will see that its extension is let me show you its extension here. You see that its extension is dot x. But when you try to see this, we see that its extension is .vbp. Thank you, dear friends, for taking your time to watch this tutorial. Subscribe to my channel at the label nail and never forget to subscribe. Never forget to subscribe and never forget to watch my other tutorials which are so helpful in computer science. So, let me show you this it is very very important uh, my tutorial tutorial so so please this is these are my contacts this is my channel name this is my facebook name. this is my email address this is my website name this is my numbers Thank you for watching.